Welcome to our channel, where we dive deep into the world of electrical systems. Today, we unravel the mysteries of two crucial concepts, electrical earthing and grounding. It might sound like the same thing, but there are some key differences between earthing and grounding in electrical systems. Understanding these differences is crucial for safety and proper electrical function. In this video, we'll break down what earthing and grounding are, what their purposes are, and how they differ. Earthing generally protects humans from electrical shocks and overloading. Grounding insulates the entire system from power malfunctioning. Earthing is connected between the equipment body and earth pit, which is placed under the earth surface. Grounding is connected between the neutral of the equipment and ground. Earth is used for the protection of the human body in faulty conditions. Grounding is primarily used for unbalancing when the electric system overloads. In earthing the circuit is connected to the earth as the earth. It is an equipotential surface. In grounding, a circuit is not physically connected to the earth but the potential is zero with respect to the other points. Earthing discharges the electrical energy to the earth. The grounding provides the return path to the current. Earthing is a preventive measure. Grounding is a backup pathway in electrical systems. The wire used in earthing is green in color. The wire used for grounding is black in color. The earthing is of five types, such as pipe, plate, rod earthing, tap earthing, and strip earthing. The grounding is of four types, such as solid, resistance, resonant, and reactance grounding. So, there you have it. The crucial differences between earthing and grounding. Remember, earthing is about safety, while grounding is about system performance. Understanding these concepts is essential for anyone working with electricity. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more electrical insights. And if you have any questions or want to share your experiences, drop a comment below.